Hello, I'm Rishabh and welcome back. So, we, this is a video about a cool trap or an attack what we can use in chess. Okay. So, this attack is known as the skewer attack and it really helps when playing the game and I'll show you how to use this attack. So, we can see um, in the skewer attack we basically needs to find a weakness which means then the weakness could be two pieces in one same diagonal on the same line. So it means that if we have a bishop, then we need to find or make two pieces go to the same diagonal. And if we have a rook, in this case, we can see that the opponent's weakness is that the two knights are in this in the same line. Okay. So using this weakness, we can play rook to f3. Okay, and this is cure attack because now none of the knights can defend each other. So obviously one knight is gone. So for example, knight to um d4 and then we can play rook cross f6 okay that means um so this pawn this knight is now gone okay we can, i'll show the same example but with a bishop this time okay so here's the same attack okay the skewer attack okay, but instead this time it's with a bishop so the weakness is that that both the knights are in the same diagonal and we can attack using the skewer attack by playing bishop to h2 now as you can see the both both knights are attacked now so none of them can defend themselves like even any type of move like knight to um, e2 none of the moves can save the knight okay but during always during any attack this just a tip make sure none of the pieces can attack to your king which means giving check okay so we should always make sure that the piece cannot attack to the king and in the next move like in this position even if opponent plays i think knight c6 we can simply capture the knight and then of course um this bishop is now you see the position is equal before black was stronger and now what we fight and black are equal so this is how we use a skewer attack thank you for watching the video See you next time.